So I'm in my committee. Um, I expected to see uh, the arrogance of the guys there. I was I was already prepared for the guys to you know stand up and just talk about nonsense and it was just, I, I was I was you know prepared for it. I was, sorry, Dr. Sharkin. So, sorry. Sorry. <laughs> This year was mostly about meeting each other, meeting other people's needs, which is fine, and getting a piece from each of their committee, being involved, having to know about at least one aspect of each committee because if they were unsure about something, they would text me these long paragraphs. Too much for their country, and then you had the ones that had to pass resolutions for a grade for school, so they were pushing that, which caused conflict without the entire body because that's not what report bodies are supposed to do. But overall, it was a really great experience, and we did. We actually completed two reports on both topics that we were covering, which apparently is not very common. So they were very impressed by it. I just learned so much about myself and about what I want to do with my career. I learned to have a love-hate relationship with politics. <laughs> <laughs> and I learned why things don't get passed in Congress as quickly as we would like it for them to. <laughs> yes. Like on it, like... They knew about this their whole life, and I was like, <laughs> I have no thing, so. But it was a good experience, and just getting to interact with a lot of other people from like different cultures and backgrounds, and just seeing what they had to say. Okay, I learned that I actually can be quiet. <laughs> <laughs> The no passing was horrible. I hated it. But like I observed that I would just talk through that if I needed to talk to somebody. Um, I, the I think it was the first or second day. Sweden, which I don't y'all don't laugh at me. <laughs> Sweden took a liking to Mexico and sent me a note that asked if I wanted to join him and the United Kingdom in world domination. I said no. Well, I said yes, but <laughs> I meant no. I'm not sure why not. <laughs> issues like that we had to go in and defend or represent our country based on and even though it's stuff like malaria or education or poverty people all want to go at it their own with their own point of view and even though we all have the same goal everyone has a different way of trying to fix the problem and nobody wants to really come together everyone a lot of the people in my community <laughs> um, like today, I was the only representative in, um, from Mexico in my committee, and I would describe myself as a powerhouse. Because I mean, because I, you know, I had to do everything on my own, and I made sure that um, Mexico had an input in everything. Although it was only one of me, and I couldn't sit down and write a resolution um, by myself, I made sure that um, I worked with others to have Mexico represented properly. Um, I loved the conference. I seem to remember from, from other years that one of the comments that delegates made was that, that delegates from other schools didn't necessarily take the work very seriously. I, I remember thinking that there were some people up there just for a trip to Chicago and that they weren't really mm -hmm. doing the right representation. I didn't hear that this time. I heard sort of the opposite, that mm -hmm. there were some people up there who were making a career out of this, right? They, they knew everything. <laughs> so so is it just a different group of people this time, or did you also see some people, some schools that where they did every group? I think this year, the whole dynamic of the body as a collective was different. Um, last year, people, delegates were older, maybe mid-twenties and up. Mm -hmm. You always have that one school that I think they're like an evening college that comes, so you do have that delegation. But last year, they just seemed older. This year, even our delegation is younger than last year, which is why we only had uh, two returners. Um, so they're younger, um, they're more willing to learn, <clears throat> and in retrospect, they're not grown. Prepared, they try to overpower everyone and make um, everyone just sign this. This well, you need to sign this because it's that that instead of listening to others, because listening is sometimes better than um, legislating and talking and lobbying. You have to be a perfect listener to um, get all your goals 
accomplished. So it was frustrating working with those type of people because you not you don't care what I'm saying. Successful in getting those resolutions mm -hmm. passed that mm -hmm. they tried to bludgeon. Mm -hmm. uh, Some got dumbed down a little bit. Yeah. Tia, what is it that you said the first? We we all gathered together like oh, the morning Lord, after our first <laughs> meeting, and Tia was like, "Some of these people here are so smart, smart they're dumb." Oh, that's <laughs> really cool. So, how are we feeling about Uganda? Oh boy, I thought that was cool. That wasn't our first choice list, to say the mm -hmm. least. Well, I what? Think it's kind of exciting. exciting. It is yeah. way yeah. 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 What number were we? Did you? Uh, yeah, I counted. We were 66. Okay, so oh, we wow. were 66. Oh, out of like 76. 76. <laughs> but, uh, we had some first, choice, first choices, and then it got down to it. You have, what, five minutes to Yeah, five choose, minutes to decide. what you want, and we have to. Important. Mm -hmm. I think it was something for Janessa and I to switch from a Middle Eastern country yeah, to a Latin American, American country. Mm -hmm. It'll be something for these guys who return next year to switch from a Latin American country to a African, African country. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. You're going to always want Mexico in your heart. Like, we're always going to be happy. I have no choice. It is. It's dramatic So how do you call somebody out on I would probably say point yes. of information. Right, agreed. You know, I wouldn't One. say that. Constantly I actually did that to my mom when I was home. <laughs> <laughs> When I got to come and hear from last year's model you in Pakistan, this was a highlight of this year. Thank you so much for this opportunity.